Sagittarius, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the week of January 29, 2018. Thank you guys for stopping by and welcome to my new subscribers. If you guys are seeking a psychic reading, you will find a link to that below this video, as well as I recommend that you check my live calendar for availability because it's updated often and hopefully sometime this week we'll be doing a live broadcast. Okay, this week for Sagittarius kind of all over the place guys um new doors opening up but at the same time there's there's money coming in but then there's something quick to anger you uh possibility of an upset with a child that's close to you just a lot of scattered energy maybe some live music so just kind of across the board for Sagittarius so let's take a look this is for Sagittarius for your week of January 29th 2018 Sagittarius start with the Ace of Cups, followed by the Lover's Card, the Seven of Swords, Major Arcana of the Hermit, the Knight of Swords, and the Six of Pentacles. I'm going to break this down for you guys and we'll pull you three more. Starting with the Love Life here with the Ace of Cups and the Lover's Card for my single Sagittarius. This is going to be significant. This could be something new coming into play. Uh, there is a warning attached to that. I'll get to that in just a moment. Uh, for those that are uncoupled in relationship situation, um, this could be some rocky communications for you guys. And I say this because this is followed up with that Seven of Swords. Seven of Swords is a direct lie. It is someone being dishonest with you and it is deceit. This applies in the love life across the board for Sagittarius for the upcoming week. So just be mindful of that as you go through your week. Next, we have the Hermit. Now, I love the Hermit because the Hermit, if you take a look at that, see that he's got the lantern there. This indicates to me that you guys are on the right path. Okay? It's also what I call the card of wisdom. It's wise decisions moving forward in a strong manner. Beside that, we have the Knight of Swords, and the Knight of Swords is that moving forward, but it's also something that's coming rushing in. It is an opportunity involving your finances. Six of Pentacles shows you guys are working and gaining, but this could be an addition to that regular paycheck. This could be a side job. This could be something different, but definitely working and gaining new opportunities in the financial sector. Moving forward, we have the Two of Wands, we have the Ten of Cups, and we have the Four of Swords. Smooth sailing, guys. Two of Wands, making plans, not necessarily putting action behind them yet, but making plans. Perhaps you're lighting up things for spring. Ten of Cups, total and complete happiness on the home front. Things are going along well there. And then we have that Four of Swords, and the Four of Swords is a strong need for rest. Okay, and it could be meditation. It just means time to yourself. And be mindful of that as you go through the week. So what you're looking at, new beginnings in the love life. We have the lover's card, okay? But we also remember there's some deceit attached to that this week, okay? Across the board. And then we have the wisdom card. You guys are on the right path doing what you're supposed to do for the time being. So thank you for watching. Please take the time to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you soon. Bye.